Hi guys, uh, I'm gonna show you today how to do the download for firmware or the software for the XDJRX Pioneer. Uh, first thing we have to go to the website for, for Pioneer. Uh, then we go for product. And then we go all in one system. And then we go to uh, XDJRX. And then we go for support. And when you go for support, you just go for firmware update. And you download the link. So when you press on the link, you download it. And then we go to, I already downloaded the file. It's just I wanna show you. So download, this is the file. Okay, so we get the file and we put it on 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 USB, which is already uh, already the file. It's being transferred to to my USB, and now uh, let's go to the machine and show you how to do it on the XDJRX. Okay, so the first thing is the very important thing is before we turn on the machine, we have to press the two button, uh, which is the stop. This one, it's on the left hand side, not on the, on the right hand side. Okay, so uh, we press the USB one stop and with the uh, reload uh, exit, this button. So we press it together and then we turn on the machine. Okay, so when we press two and we turn on the machine, let's see what's gonna happen. Okay, we keep pressing on it. Okay, and then now we're gonna have a message here which is connect your SP storage device into your SP port. Okay, so what we have to do is basically we got the SP here and just you plug it in here and the machine start automatically load uh, the file. Already I load the file here. Okay, it's been loaded, so I'm gonna turn it off. So when the, the of course when the file been loaded on the machine, just you turn it off and then we turn it on again okay and now definitely you got the the version which is 1.5 okay and if you want to check the, the version you can uh, it's very easy i'll show you just we press the the menu bottle the menu button and just we go down scroll it down to to the last one and here it's showing is 1.5 all right guys enjoy it Thank you.